Oh, shalom, shalom. I want to start this by giving all honor, all praise, and all glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashem, Rekha Kadash, to this world ignorantly calls God and Jesus Christ in the ancient Paleo Hebrew tongue. I want to give double honors to my elders over our camp here in South Carolina, Elder Kazak. I want to give double honors to the elders of Great Millstone who teach you all who rule well. I want to give honors to the brothers who's doing this thing in the weekend and week out, man, in truth and in sincerity. I want to give a shout out to the speckled bird causing confusion among the heathen while looking like the heathen. To all y'all brothers, I like to say, Shalom. Now, this is a video of this, uh, this fucking nigga right here, man. Yo, this nigga is the ultimate scoffer, bro. It says, Great Millstone leader to har is child, uh, leader to har is child molester. I'm pissed. Raging Hebrew Israelites exposed. This nigga is crazy, okay? So listen to the bugged out shit he talking about, bro. He don't, and you can tell that, that a nigga like this, man, this is a nigga that don't understand the scriptures, man. He don't understand the scriptures. I'm gonna start it. What's the fucking deal, you two? I'm sick of these child molesting motherfuckers. You know what's crazy about the Hebrew Israelite camps? They can sit around here and be disgusting and talk about playing with little children and try to use scripture as a way to justify why they're believing or have this certain uh, belief and what they claim to be right. Now, what's crazy is you do, you remember you guys, uh, I know you guys probably know about his name is uh, Tahar. He's a, a, a general Tahar of the uh, great uh, Millstone Israelite camp. You know, the leader, the guy who talked about that we're going to get uh, underage kids in the kingdom of God. Time out. The scriptures do not say underage kids, man. But don't say that, bro. This nigga clearly does not know the scriptures, man. And he's just talking out the fucking side of his neck, you know. Just like, um, with, uh, with, um, damn, I forgot the, the, uh, ISUPK, man. Um, them guys used to, used to talk about, um, uh, GMS was wrong about the, the whole rape doctrine thing, you know. But, yo, it, yo, when, when you, when you want a woman and she's available, she's a virgin, bro, you can grab her and take her if you have the means to pay for that to pay for that woman's clothing and her food, you know what I'm saying? And you can take her in, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's what's considered rape today. Back in the days of old, that's not rape. But now them niggas is teaching that, you know? You see, motherfuckers, they misconstrue the scriptures, bro. And they don't know the damn scriptures. Like this motherfucker right here. He don't know a damn thing about what the hell he's talking about, man. He has no idea, man. He has no idea. He's just talking, bro. It's, it's irritating, but, but I mean, damn, bro. God, you fat, nasty bastard. You sick fucking bastards. And these are people that you, you... Yo, and then he's 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 scoffing and mocking the prophet, man. He gonna be put to death for that. You know what I'm saying? Calling him out his name and doing all that, you know, carrying on. Yo, this, this man is gonna be fucking put to death for that type of shit. You know what I'm saying? He just don't know what he got coming for him. The Lord probably gonna do this nigga in the worst way, man. Honestly. To fucking follow, and everybody at the Great Millstone, all the Great Millstone Israelites ought to go to hell. You nasty child molesting motherfuckers. <laughs> Snake's crazy. You see, he's talking about you ought to go to hell. Nigga, we in hell right now. The earth is hell. The earth is hell. He's stupid, man. He he don't know the scriptures and he's just talking. He probably just some some Christian motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? That that uh that I mean that's a Christian. <laughs> so he's saying this type of shit, you know what I mean? Because Christians definitely don't understand the scriptures. Nobody but but the true Jews is gonna understand the scriptures and bring it. Well, no, I, I'm not gonna say that because some you got Edomites that understand the scriptures, you know what I'm saying? But Yo, this motherfucker here don't don't understand the scriptures or grasp nothing, man. He talking about we in hell. This nigga's crazy. All oh, love you. Up in the e -E, twitching, y'all are disgusting. <laughs> How can you follow any doctrine from a man who who claims that we're going to be playing with that that he's going to be having sex with underage kids? Talking about they going he going to get them young. What? Kind, kind, but we it's not going to be no fucking underage kids, man. 
You you can have a, a woman that's 17, 18, bro. You know what I'm saying? In the kingdom, you gonna have all we gonna have all type of women. You know, you know for for those men are, that are uh, of the elect. I mean, I mean, shit. They you just gonna have women. You know, you're not gonna have no fucking eight and nine year olds and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like what the fuck? You know, you're not you're not gonna do that. But the fuck shit is this? These fat, nasty, pastrami eating, shit eating motherfuckers. Why? Why would you even believe in them? But these, but yet these are you quote unquote Hebrew Israelites, and these Hebrew Israelite camps they gotta go, man. That dog shit. They need to be put in the toilet. I got a fucking headache because of the shit, man. So we know that Tahar or Tata is not going when he starts when when there's any kind of um, I ain't going to him. To ask nothing about the Bible, because first of all, you're nasty and you're sick. Because no religion is gonna make me go and play with no kids. You nasty motherfuckers. First off, this is not a religion. It's a heritage and it's a culture given directly from the Lord to Israel, to his his people. You know what I mean? You know his darling people. So it's it's not a fucking religion, man. The word religion is not in the Bible. Once again, this nigga is crazy. Need to be put in jail. You disgusting and you sick <laughs> and, and polite and Sanetta asked him. How can you And that's another reason why this nigga is bugged the fuck out. And you listen to uh to to that dumbass fucking polite and to Sarnetto. Man, man, you listen to Sarnetto, man. You you gone. You don't listen to some damn Sarnetta, man. This this nigga is really bugged out. Yo. Sarnetta's really gone, bro. Ultimately gone. Big gone. You watch this video, you just say, man, man, what the fuck? But but you know what's funny? No matter what this crazy ass nigga says, yo, Sarnetto understands that the Christians can't deal with with, with the Hebrew Israelites, man. Polite can't either, man. Polite used to always pull up on um on uh, uh on Elder Tahar and them, man, when they were over there on uh on Eighth Street or what whatever it was in, in New York. Whatever it was, he used to always pull up on them cats, man, and and, and he he used to get ripped, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because the 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 ways of man are not gonna stand up to the truth, bro. The ways of man are not gonna stand up to the truth at all, bro. It's not gonna stand up, you know what I'm saying? Believe that we're gonna be. They, they couldn't believe the shit that this fat, nasty motherfucker was saying about playing with little kids. He's disgusting, man. And I feel, I mean, I mean man, it's disgusting, man. I mean, gross. But these are the people that y'all respect and love and follow as your so-called religious leaders. Shit, no, not me. I mean, man, but <sighs> Tahar is just one of the ones that are was in his heart came out and they sick man they sick bastards man <laughs> I'm out man I, I can't talk about this no more <laughs> <laughs> oh shit niggas crazy man <laughs> this nigga is wild are bro the people that talk. this nigga is wild man you see this nigga is crazy anyway I'm gonna get some scriptures man cause we we not worried about what the fuck he's talking about this man is stupid literally he's stupid Yo, and this is why we're not listening to this nigga, man. It's Matthew 10 and 14. Whoever shall not receive you, nor hear your words, when ye depart out of that house or city, shake the dust off your feet, man. You see? So we're not, we not worried about what, what the fuck he's talking about, man. You know? We, we, we're not worried about him, because he, he's, he's a dumbass, man. He's a dumbass. He he don't he don't get nothing, man. He don't get nothing. He's stupid, literally. He's gone. Even the Lord says that he's gone, you know? You know? Hosea 4 and 6. My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. Because thou hast rejected knowledge, I will also reject thee. That thou shalt uh, be no priest to me. Seeing thou hast forgotten the law of Yahweh thy power, also, I will also forget thy, tr thy, thy children. You know, but, yo, this nigga is going to be destroyed, man. 
He's gonna he's gonna be destroyed. He he relax he he, he he's reluctant to to try and grab the the truth, you know what I'm saying? Because the Lord ain't dealing with him, man. So he he's destined for 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 death off tops, man. You know? He's destined for death off tops. Is a Sirach twenty two and thirteen. Talk not much with a fool, and go not to him that had no understanding. Beware of him, lest I have trouble, and thou shalt never be defiled with his fooleries. Depart from him, and thou shalt find rest, uh, and never be disquieted with madness. You see? So, we're we not dealing with that crazy old nigga, man. We're not dealing with him, man. That nigga is nuts, bro. He's nuts, man. He's nuts. Look, it's Proverbs 23 and 9. Speak not in the ears of a fool, for he will despise the wisdom of thy words, man. Well, once again, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know, I mean, shit. Uh, it's, not, it's nothing you can say to a nigga like that, man. It's nothing you can say to him. He's He's literally gone. He's literally gone, man. I'm going to get um, one more scripture, and I'm going to close this out. But, yeah, man, that nigga is the ultimate scoffer, bro. We're not dealing with him, man. We're not dealing with him. We waiting on niggas like him to be fucking put to death, man. You know what I'm saying? Let me see. Well, no, I was going to get this, but, no, nah, it's cool. I'm going to go ahead and end it, man. Say shalom.